You can change the data format for a field to change how the values are displayed. For example, you can change the number of digits or decimal places displayed in a number, the maximum length of a character string, the format of a date field, or apply a custom format by typing in the web focus language designation. You can apply format changes to fields from the data source that were added to the chart, as well as to define and compute fields. In this data grid, we can see sales information for each day. We're using sale date as a sort field. By default, the date field has a format of YYMD, year, month, day. We can change that to a format that shows month, day, year and uses the full month name rather than the number. To change the format of a field, right-click it from the bucket and point to Format Data. The data format for the field appears. You can change the field format of character, number, date, or custom formatted fields. In this case, we're changing the format of a date field. For date, you can change the date format and, since the current format uses separators, we could change those as well. Instead, let's use the format that shows the full month name and then click OK. There are also many different format options available for numeric fields. You can show numeric data as an integer, such as the quantity sold field in this grid, a decimal value, as shown in the cost of goods field in this example, as a currency value, as shown in the gross profit field, or as a percentage. Let's add the profit margin field to this data grid to show how to use a percentage format and how to change the format of a calculated field. We'll create profit margin as a new compute and change the format from the field calculator which you can do for defines and computes. Profit margin is the result of gross profit divided by revenue. Right-click gross profit and click New Calculation. Creating the compute from this field will include it automatically in the calculation. To complete the formula for profit margin, click the divided by symbol, then find revenue and add it to the calculation. Let's change the format of this compute field to a percentage. Click the Edit Format button. By default, the format is a decimal value, with two digits after the decimal point and a length of 12 characters, which includes the decimal point, decimal digits, and other characters. To change this field to a percentage, click the Percent Type button. Using the Percent Format in Designer automatically multiplies the computed value by 100 so that it displays correctly. Click OK to accept the compute, and run the chart to see our format changes. Since we're using a data grid as the chart type, it is easy to see the formatting changes that we made to the sale date and profit margin fields, and the default format used for the other fields. If you use a more graphical chart type, you can see the field format changes in the axis labels, or in the tooltip that appears when you point to a section of the chart. Changing the format allows you to modify how the raw information from your data source is interpreted and displayed in the chart enhancing the visible information or making it more intuitive. To learn more, visit the WebFocus Knowledge Base, where you can search all technical topics and videos.